So he's called Mary Contrary. It was a bleak Monday, fog-ridden and bland. Nothing notable happened, not sad and not grand. The night that had followed was coldest that year. Mary stirred a fire and wallowed in fear. Was it the clock ticking in the pitch black holes? Or the ominous shadows, can candle cast on walls? Was it the heartbeat wild in her chest? Or maybe it was an uninvited guest? You. Mary took the candle with a quivering light and tiptoed to her chamber, fighting her fright, entered her bedroom and double locked the door and started to change, shaking to the core. Was it the branches clawing the clouds? Was it the thieves wrapped up in shrouds? Was it the owls hooting for moon or was someone watching her down on a dune? Mary pulled the covers over her chin frozen to move, screaming within. Something was stirring by the window outside. The candle burnt out, there was nowhere to hide. Knock two, three, cut in the silence. Mary screaming for an oncoming violence. And hand over mouth, she cannot draw breath. Her eyes bulging horror, anticipating death. Just when poor Mary ran out of choice, she heard a miracle, her most favorite voice. Mary, oh Mary, calm yourself, please. I am your father, I forgot my keys. That's it, thank you. <laughs>